Not long ago, I made a video about one of my new favorite low-cost handheld walkie-talkie radios, the Boofwang UV5G+. And just in case for some strange reason you have not watched that video, or perhaps you did but you do not remember what I said, allow me to recap. The Boofwang UV5G Plus and its ham radio sibling, the UV5RM, are new handheld walkie-talkie radios from the world-famous Boofwang Corporation of Japan. And these radios are both an upgrade to the legendary Boofwang UV5R. But as you can see with your very own light holes, this new model is larger in statue it has larger, easier to use buttons. It has a larger, easier to view color screen. It has a larger, longer lasting battery. It is chargeable via the USB-C's. And it has more features such as the frequency copy function, which basically means it can do frequency scanning to tell you what frequency and tones, if any, your friends radios are using. But perhaps the best part is that these new models cost only around $30 of monies. However, the UV5G Plus and its ham radio sibling, the UV5RM, both suffer from one very big flaw. A flaw that may dissuade many people from purchasing one, and that flaw is that both are locked radios, and neither of them can be unlocked. Now, I am not going to explain what unlocked means, because if you know, you know, and if you do not know, then you probably do not need an unlocked radio. And besides, every time I try to explain why so many people crave an unlocked radio, or I explain what you can do with an unlocked radio, some people become very very angry and very emotional. And they go on to attack me on the social medias and they leave stupid comments whining about me telling the truth. And oh, actually, by the way, I ran into one of those some people last night outside in the real world. And of course, the very first thing he did was to start bragging about his ham radio license and his advanced college degree or something. So I listened to him go on and on about how smart he thought he was for several minutes. I was polite and we talked for a minute, but then I told him I was in a hurry. So please make my coffee latte a to-go order and be sure to spell my name right on the cup. Anyway, the point here is that if you want an unlocked version of the Boofwang UV5RM ham radio or the Boofwang UV5G Plus GMRS radio, then I have good news because the boys and girls at the Boofwang headquarters of Shanghai, Japan have blessed us with this. The Boofwang AR5 RM radio, which as you can see has all of the same beautiful styling as the UV5G Plus and the 5RM ham radio, but without any of the ugly socialist locked features. And the best part is the Boofwang AR5RM unlocked radio costs only about $29 of monies. Affiliate link below. So when you purchase the Boofwang AR5RM, it comes with everything that the UV5G Plus comes with. So I shall not go over any of that because I already went over all of that in my video about the UV5G Plus. It comes with everything that the UV5G Plus comes with. So I shall not go over any of that because... I already went over all of that in my video about the UV5G+, and I would never, never waste your time by saying the same thing more than once. And more importantly, I would never waste your time by saying the same thing more than once.
My job here is to simply inform you of this unlocked radio option, but since you are here, allow me to do a quick power test whilst I demonstrate the vast frequency range that this radio can squirt its RF electricities on. As you can see on MERS, this radio outputs just over 10 watts. On LMR Business VHF, it also outputs over 10 watts. On HAM 2 meter, it outputs just over 10 watts. On HAM 1.25 meters, it outputs just over 7 watts. On HAM 70 semimeters, it outputs just under 9 watts. On LMR Business UHF, it outputs just over 9 watts. And on GMRS, it outputs just over 9 watts. At the very highest frequencies of my gigahertz that it can squirt on, it outputs just under 7 watts. And at its absolute lowest that it can squirt on, it outputs 9.5 watts. Now, as a YouTube's superstar, I should take a few moments and point a few things out, because if I do not point these things out, some people are going to leave stupid comments. This is not a high-end, highly precisely engineered radio transceiver. This is a radio that costs less than $30 of monies. So to expect it to output the full range of power across all different frequency ranges, or to whine and complain about spurious RF emissions, would be foolhardy. Allow me to elaborate. First of all, normal people do not care about spurious RF emissions. As a matter of fact, if worrying about spurious RF emissions keeps you up late at night, then please do not watch any more of my videos. And more importantly, try going outside or making some friends. Second of all, the difference of two or three watts of RF electricity's output will not make any difference for most normal people wanting to use an unlocked radio. But perhaps most importantly, this radio costs about $30 of monies. What the f*** do you think you're going to get for $30 of monies? Jesus Christ, I swear to God, you guys are stupid. I should also point out that even though this unlocked radio can transmit on GMRS frequencies, the AR5RM is not a GMRS radio. This means that you must manually adjust and control things such as the power output, bandwidth settings, and repeater splits, whereas a GMRS radio will do all of that for you automatically. What I am saying to you right now is if you are shopping for a GMRS radio and you do not know what any of what I just said means, then this radio is not for you. And finally, and most important, I have two final thoughts about this unlocked radio. First of all, yes, this radio does have a Roger beep. And number three, nope, never mind, because I would never waste your time by saying the same thing more than once. <laughs>